Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to Chopper Viewers. In this video, I'm just going to give you guys a quick little update on Snaphack. So, as you know, Snaphack did get pulled from the App Store uh, a little while ago, and a lot of you have been wondering why it got pulled. Well, the official reason uh, is not uh, disclosable right now, but I did get in touch with the developer, and he did tell me that uh, it w had nothing to do with the Xcode virus and all of that stuff. It has nothing to do with that, so you don't have to worry about that. If you still have it, good for you. If you delete it, you might lose it, so you know if you have it on your phone and you want to keep using it, then don't delete it. And uh, if you downloaded it from your computer on iTunes, you should be able to put it back on your phone. But in the meantime, you should get the Snaphack Lite version. Uh, it's currently free, obviously, it's the Lite version, and it's still on the App Store as of the uploading of this video. And if you download it through iTunes, again, you can easily put it back on your phone if you accidentally delete it or something like that. But if you don't um, and it gets pulled, then it's going to be difficult. But anyways, that's still up, so you can grab that uh, for now. And I believe there could be an update coming to Snaphack Free or the light version uh, pretty soon. So there have been some questions about some issues with it uh, that I saw in the App Store reviews. But uh, hopefully that will get fixed. I'm not sure. But grab that as a backup while you can. And I'm sorry I can't give you guys much more detail about this, but um, I just recommend getting that. And this had nothing to do with the virus, so you guys don't have to worry. So if you have it, uh, you can keep it and keep using it. And yeah, that's about all I got for this video, guys. It's just a quick little update video on Snaphack. So I'll see you guys in the next one. Don't forget to subscribe and like this video. Peace.